Hello everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Ark the Lad Twilight of the Spirits with me, Ultra Gamer J. The reason I took so long to introduce myself more like I do at the start of every video is due to the fact that we have an interesting um, track of background music playing and I wanted everyone to enjoy to enjoy that because after this episode we will never hear it again. I mean this is what happens when Delma is the party leader for this one occasion. Anyways, you can see that we just got through a filler fight and during that filler fight, Bebe Dora got a class up. So let's see if she can learn anything new. She cannot. That is unfortunate. Uh, Delma can't learn anything. Neither can Volk. And... Camellia can't. Oh well. Better to have a class upgrade than, than to not. That's life.
Yeah, I mean, I did not expect Volk to be that much of a muscle head. But I definitely... I am impressed that Delma is, like, is much... is definitely smart enough to be like, no, you're not going in there. Because, I mean, I will point out, Volk is very... seems to be doing perfectly fine despite the fact that his family was murdered in the outskirts of Ubel. Did he just forget that hap that it happened around Ubel specifically? And he only remembers his family his wife and son being murdered? What do we have here? It's good that you do that, since we do need those. Okay. And then there was one. I guess I should have been more specific and said this chapter is the only time we heard we hear this background music. But we're going to hear some some more unique ba background music now. It's not the same track though. Yeah, we only this is the oh this is like, one of two scenarios where we hear this. We won't be hearing this particular background music again until m a bit later. Or rather, more specifically, the next dark chapter. Also, Baby Dora should not talk about herself the way she did. She is not a doll, marionette, or puppet, or whatever. She, she is not a gun. She is who she chooses to be. And she should choose to be a... A proud member of Ultra Gamer J Industries. Ultra Gamer J Industries, ready, ready to make a better tomorrow. Later. Come on, don't you want to inspect the grave? Wonder why humans bury themselves? I am surprised that no one has defaced that grave by like sticking on a, taking a piece of tape and putting a piece of paper on it that says that after that, that says Deimos fucker.
Eh, give it time, I suppose. Boy, oh boy, I sure do love being a hu human and then having to eat eat and then then defecate to make room for more food. Let's go with the nat her natural response. You could say she's visiting. You could say that she's not from around here. That she's just passing through. What's a card? What does bad to worse mean? Are you my enemy? Do you want razor floss around your throat? Because that's how you get razor floss around your throat. Yeah, too bad Volk made him, made sure Lloyd had a little accident. I'll show myself out.
yeah, every time, the more Baby Dora says, well, that she is Baby Dora, I feel like I want to see her doing a Broadway musical, or at the very least Saturday Night Live parody, or song parody of I'm Just Ken from the Barbie movie. Or actually, maybe more on par with the SNL parody I'm Just Pete by Pete Davidson. Honestly, I'm I am if B Paulette had asked where her parents were, had asked that specific question, I'm Paul chances are Baby Dora would have responded with what are parents? And Paulette would just look at her and be like, and she'd say, that is the saddest thing I have ever heard. But I'm, I'm very confused as to why Paulette feels jealousy. Is this about Tatjana again? She just joined the team and she's a former knockoff Nazi scientist. Paulette, you have nothing to be jealous about. Besides, your little whip thing is way cooler than her gun, than Tatjana's gun that turns her invisible. I mean, sure, Tatjana's weapon is pra much more practical, but you have earned, you earned your place on the team. And once, and once this whole ordeal is over with, you're not going to be in prison like she probably will be. Or at the very least doing a crap load of community service. This seems like the... This seems like the more interesting option. Well, it is kind of amusing that he... that blood didn't burst out of his back as the wings shot out of them. Well, wouldn't it be cool if humans did have wings? Yeah, but, I mean, who wouldn't want to have wings out of their back? I mean, the wings are prob were probably useless because he couldn't maneuver them like he you could an arm or a leg. But, so, they served no purpose besides decoration. Well, he's only half Deimos. Like, he's not, so he's only, which means he's half human, so he's just Karg. Yes, but wouldn't it be, but to reiterate, wouldn't it be cool if you could fly and the, if, if you had wings, then you could fly. How did she trick you? By saying that she didn't do dance the mattress jig with a Deimos? You didn't you never asked. You didn't even know that Dark or that Karg was a about Dark until like yesterday in game time. And how exactly was she trying to trick you? What, what did you think she was trying to accomplish? Especially since the monarchy that she came from was abolished or disassembled or whatever.
so. Can it really be betrayal if even Karg himself didn't know who his dad was? Because every time he asked, asked, Mom, who is, who's my dad? She would dodge the question. Maybe a, now, there is a chance that Nafia regrets banging Windolf, but I doubt she regrets having Karg or Dark. Yeah, why would they? That thought process is completely asinine. Obligatory. What is a family? My name is Dende, I mean, Baby Dora. You do not screw with the Black Mage. Which home? The one in Orca? The one in Ruelun? Or the one that's up, up in Dracurnia? Yeah, Baby Dora doesn't really have a permanent, a, um, what do you call it, default home. Well, that's, well, you certainly have better weapon control laws than Texas, where you need literally no permission to own a gun, un, and yet, ironically, every permission to see a doctor. That's not even tackling the fact that the infrastructure is crumbling. There should be an E and a D at the end of mur that murder. Probably an A before the Deimos, but after the buy. Well, technically, some of her you could attribute some of her misfortunes to the Dillsweld Empire. Imagine Karg was pretty shaken up when, was just as shaken up when Lloyd died as Paulette was because uh, Lloyd was the closest thing Karg had to a dad. Then why did he say he wanted to kill Deimos? Let's screw with him. I am trying and failing miserably to gaslight you. 
I think. Not, not in the slightest, since you added that little last bit in. You're just jealous of Karg's swag. Try telling that to all the cowards on Twitter and Tumblr. Yeah, you might sneak some knockoff Nazi tech into their windmills. How horrifying. I would assume nowhere, because this is literally the first time you and Bebe Dora are meeting each other, Tachana. I mean, unless you saw a picture of her in a textbook, but that seems very unlikely. I really want to go with the third one first, but we need to do the second one, because vegetables before dessert. Why not ask Gons for help? I mean, if he can fix an airship, he can probably fix that. How much energy does Hubel need, dare I ask? I mean, you use virtually no electricity. Uh, all of your lights seem to be operated by candle. I just... Uh, I don't get this world sometimes. This one. So, like how you do to everyone who doesn't follow the Bible to the letter, despite the fact that you cherry pick whichever parts of the Bible you want to follow, Karen? But 
You tell lies all the time. Like how you tell your husband that you're not boinking the mailman. You make that sound like it's a bad thing. Well, they're never going to. And that's a good thing. Can it really be a lie if he does if he didn't know himself? I think this that's a this is a case of plausible deniability. Whoa! Watch your father fucking language, young man! I'm sorry, I had to do that little bit of hypocritical humor. I couldn't resist. I bet he probably didn't even let you join a union either! The monster! Wait, wouldn't the Defense Corps, by its very nature, be a union? I don't know anymore. If only you knew who Bebe Dora's surrogate family was. Or who they were. Oh, titty biscuits. But how did she know about the Deimos and Chaos Forest? Volk was probably doing something stupid, wasn't he? Yes, Jerry, I am accusing Volk of being an idiot because he's the dumb muscle of the group. And I thought he knew better. Nihilistic option for the last. by pointing out the fact that you didn't even know he was a Deimos until recently? A 
again, I think plaus you can make plausible deniability work in your favor here. Assuming that's how it's used. one more person we need to talk to. And yet he wasn't in the place that I thought he would be. He's gotta be around here somewhere. Seriously, the man is going to be so awkward when Karg comes back to his house. I mean, I suppose he could always have Maru be his room housemate. And probably Gons.
Maru, that sounds like a very poorly thought out idea that could very easily backfire. Oh wow, there's actually a fight scene in here. I completely forgot about that. Time for battle. No mercy. There. Guess it can't be a gang up. Oh well. It's over for you. Special delivery. What seems to be the problem?
Yeah, I mean, you handled that filler it's fight pretty turn. well. You mean to tell me you can't handle a few mercenaries without Dark to hold your hand? Well played. Time for battle. One back attack deserves another. No mercy. Yeah. Delivery. I hate you. Hiya. Didn't even scratch me. Last chance. Oh shit, I better heal up. Be strong! The battle wages on! Sure! Oh wait, I could just... Yeah! It's my turn now. Wow, he's still not dead. Okay. Didn't even scratch me. You need more practice. Not in as much pain as I thought she would be. Good for her. Good for this team. Prepare to meet your makeup. Ha! That's an odd thing to say to a human. Hey. Provided you're a Deimos, I mean. Last chance. You need more practice. Time for battle. Ah, oh, shoot. Guess I'll have to wait to get that gold. I'll slice you to pieces. Double hit. Are you ready for me, kitty? Aw, I can't. <laughs> hit the jackpot, we did. Damn it! Look here. 
really want to level up Camellia. She needs it. Nice try. Wuss! That didn't even scratch me. I'm on the prowl. Ooh. It's my turn now. Can I? Can I? Can I? Can I? Oh, 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 oh boy.
There should have been an about before that the. Well, that episode was a lot longer than I thought it would be, but I think I'm going to end things here. This has been Ultra Gamer J signing off, hoping to see you all in the next video, and please remember to like and subscribe for more content.